Good morning, boys and girls. Today is week two, day one, Monday, April 6th. And I'm going to break this into two parts. The first YouTube will be about reading, and then the second one will be about math. So I tried super hard to ask the puppies to come and join me this morning, but they're being a little standoffish. Think about that word, standoffish. Yep, they don't want to be included. Couldn't even get them to do it with a treat. But we know they're kind of stubborn at times, don't we? All right, let's go to that calendar for today. So this week it's blue. And I've um, marked off everything except reading and the reading for today. And I know we have some new grandmas and grandpas joining us. So I want to make sure and go nice and slow so that we can all be on the same page and walk through. Maybe someone else, someone new is helping you this week. So I think that's cool. So this is day one, April 6th, and it says, read the take-home book, Hubert and Frankie. And I don't have an example of that that's up at, up at school, but um, I didn't want to go up there any more than I have to. And so I know that you're going to read that twice. And then the next thing you're going to do is watch Brain Pop on Plot and Theme. Plot and Theme, and we're going to go over that a little bit in just a minute. And then log on to Spelling City for the story words, Bad Dog Dodger. Wow. Bad Dog Dodger. It's, it's a good story. It's one of my top 10 uh, favorites. So I know you're going to like it too. Um, everybody in that story learns a lot. The dogs do, the family does, the, yeah, it, you're going to like it. So um, if you have trouble with taking the test later in the week, on Spelling City, you're, I love that you do it on paper and pencil. That's awesome. So do what works for you and your family, but I hope you can go on and take the games or play the games and stuff. Sorry, my voice is kind of funny today. Um, I, You know, I have allergies and there's a lot of allergen allergies out there. Pollen, mold, and that's everything I'm allergic to. So I'm staying well. Mr. C is staying well, but I do, I have my allergies this morning. So let's go to plot and theme. You're going to remember these because we've been going back and forth to them. Let's do the first one. This one's plot. And plot, boys and girls, is just sequencing. Beginning, middle, and end. So what happened in the beginning? Middle, remember we looked for those uh, sequence words later after that. And then, of course, end. So plot just means helping us to understand the story using beginning, middle, and end. And it's used to help us uh, with what are we are to learn from the story. What's the big idea? What does the author want us to take away from the story? So plot, and then the other one, boys and girls, is theme. And like I just mentioned, that's the big idea. And what the author wants we as readers to learn from the story. Yeah, so Mo Willems does a lot of theme, doesn't he? He has a lot of big ideas in his books. Well, so do other stories, boys and girls. What the author wants readers to learn from the story, that's theme. So you can have a good review and practice on that when you go to Brain Pop, Plot and Theme. And remember, that's on the second grade learning, distance learning page. So hopefully you won't have any trouble with that again this week. So let me know if you do. Um, our new families that are joining us, um, let me know any questions. I love answering questions, and that's why I'm here. Okay? So, and then Spelling City. And the story this week is Bad Dog Dodger. Now, a lot of you, or a few of you have asked, what about Friday? Friday is actually not a distance learning, or excuse me, a school day, but I will be doing my thing as always. So if you want to uh, keep going and treat it as any other day, you can. And if you want to take a break, I've sent you a modified calendar for that yesterday on an email, and I can send that out again. <clears throat> I want to give a shout out to the kids that have been doing IXL. I'm going to start printing certificates and sending those to you in the mail. I think we all like to get mail. And so, um, boys and girls, jump on IXL and do some math, all right? 
This week you can do a uh, letter U, three dimensional shapes. Okay, and I'll discuss that in the math part. All right, so that was just for reading. And Bad Dog Dodger, um, you're gonna like this story, boys and girls. I think your families might even too. Scooby Doo, I'd love it if you'd read it twice and be sure to ask questions. Hey, do you wanna do some time tests? Those are also located on distance learning. Math facts time tests. And those are on distance learning. Again, if you need help, you will have to print those out, of course. If you don't have access to a printer, uh, send me an email and I'll put them in the mail. I'm so wanting this to go well for you and your families. All right? So that's it for reading. Uh, week two, day one. Adios. And I'll get started on the math one.